What is up, guys? Welcome back to Bring Me Joy-Con. So finally, they're adding games to the Nintendo Online. Back uh, before they were doing every month, they were adding new NES games, usually two, sometimes three. And then when they launched the Super Nintendo, they said, you know, we're not going to do this every single month anymore, but we'll continue adding games. We're just going to go away from this every single month uh, program that we're doing. And they just announced that on December 12th, uh, which isn't very far away, they will be adding some Super Nintendo games, four of them, and two NES games. And at first I was kind of disappointed with the list, um, but that's I think mainly just because they're games that I personally haven't played a whole lot of. And then I thought, well, you know what? Uh, this is actually going to be pretty cool because now I have the opportunity to play some Super Nintendo games that I've never played before, and judging by the Super Nintendo's track record, they're probably going to be decent games. Um, and then the NES games, I, I had never heard of either of those before either, and so I'm actually kind of uh, a little more optimistic about this now. I, I'm pretty excited. So um, for Super Nintendo, they're adding Star Fox 2. I've never played that before. Uh, it was made for the Super Nintendo. It was like 99% complete back in the day, and they never released it on the original Super Nintendo. And a lot of people wished they had, and I know there were like some ROMs of it out there that you could get a hold of back in the day, which of course uh, is technically illegal, um, because there was no way for anyone to rip uh, their own because it was never released. So Nintendo was really the only people that uh, should have had that. And people figured out a way to get a hold of it. Um, so the first official release of Star Fox 2 was actually on the Super Nintendo Classic, which is a very cool thing that Nintendo brought that forward um, for the release of that. And now they're adding it to the Switch Online, and I've never really played it. The Star Fox that I played the most was the N64 version. Um, I know that for the Super Nintendo's time, uh, Star Fox was pretty revolutionary. It's very hard to get good 3D graphics on a 16-bit, two-dimensional system. So it was a, a pretty revolutionary thing. It was amazing that they could even pull it off. It was um, sort of on that same level of like how they pulled off the Donkey Kong graphics. It, it just uh, most people thought it wasn't possible to have something look that good on the Super Nintendo and their uh, Star Fox 2 did it, um, so pretty cool. Uh, Super Punch-Out is another one. Um, I've never played it, but I love the original and I can't wait to try it out. I know that uh, Punch-Out on the arcade version looked fairly similar to Super Punch-Out on the Super Nintendo, um, so I'm pretty excited to finally try that out. Uh, Kirby Superstar, I'm, I'm not a huge Kirby guy, I, I appreciate Kirby for what it is, but I generally I can't just sit down and play Kirby for a long time by myself, I, I tend to get bored, um, but I will definitely give it its uh, fair chance, and I'll put at least an hour in and see if I can get into it or not. Um, Breath of Fire 2, an awesome RPG, an awesome game series. Uh, I'm really glad that this one is being added because I am an old-school RPG fan. 16-bit uh, RPGs are some of my favorites ever, and they take me right back to my childhood. Although, uh, I've never played Breath of Fire 2, so... Uh, I mean, I, I've dabbled in it a little bit, but I've never sat down and seriously played it, so I'm excited to be able to try that out. Um, especially with the save state function that the Super Nintendo Online offers and the rewind function and all that stuff um, it should make it uh, a lot of fun to play the nes games crystallis i've never played it i know nothing about this game so another one i'm excited to play and journey to silius silius uh, must be silius i've never played that either i'm pretty excited um to try these games out because i you know thought i had played most NES games, and I thought I'd played most Super Nintendo games, but they're pulling out some that I have actually, a couple of them I've never even heard of before. So, um, you know, I, I, if you watch the channel, you know that I am an old school gamer, and 
So I'm really excited to uh, have a chance to play some of these games. I think uh, when they release, we'll probably go over some of these in separate videos, maybe. And, uh, you know, see how they are. So, thank you for watching. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoy what I do. Join us on Discord if you like to talk video games. And have a fantastic day.